Stone Stuff. Is it good? And with that question, I welcome you back to another episode of Is it good? In this series, we rank all memorial weapons from 1 to 22. Last episode was about the revolver. And today, it's all about the Stone Stuff. Feared by many, hated by most. One of the most oppressive weapons in pubs. And guys, let's take a look at it. <laughs> you know me, I haven't played it much yet, actually. Despite playing the game non-stop for four years straight. Mage has generally been the class that I didn't really touch yet. I literally don't even have it maxed. But yeah guys, surprisingly, I actually found this fun. I even went into full RP mode here and used saw uh, at least a couple times. <laughs> so guys, enjoy the highlights. I'll catch you guys at the end of the video when we actually rank the stone stuff within the weapons that we already ranked so far. See you at the end. Sheesh! Sheesh! <laughs> I didn't expect him to, to actually aim, dude. I think I'm playing high, high flyer, no worries. Time to sort the low ground, guys. I learned this in customs. Oh my god, it lasts so long. This is so stupid. Dude, this terrain, yeah? Man! Dude. Get this shit ever. Lul. This game is so laggy right now. Guys. Oh, yeah, duration for sure. High flyer needs some bombs. Damage is kinda ridiculous, right? The riding! It's not even him, I think. We got an Elm Rifle Man here. Sorry, bro, then. Actually, I'm gonna let him live so I can get more content out of him, okay? Aha, I'm a mage. I have to go to the high ground. Why are you emoting, bro? <laughs> Why are you emoting, bro? My boy, a minion. What the fuck? Where is he?
Alright, really? What up? Fuck <laughs> off! Stop chasing me! <coughs> and literally saw in here and still kill him. Back to the end. Okay, one more game and we will have content, boys. Wow, we still have some. Oh my god, you scared the fuck out of me, dude. No. Let's die, bro. Are we ready? I'm running. <laughs> Stop running. I'm doing good. Stop is getting better and better. <coughs> good caretaker, guys. Good. Need a shout out. Oh wait, I hit him for 500 damage now, yeah. And the sword. Oh, he has an axe this time. Yes. We fucking follow that. <laughs> Something else. With uh, shoes on. <laughs> I'm doing it wrong. is actually real. Are you doing the no weapon shot? Like what, what was happening? This, this is exactly what he did last time. You guys remember? He kept running to high guns until he literally walked out of the zone because he didn't want to fight me. <laughs> Got on because then he's going up. I think he's doing it again. What's this game? Man? Is he doing it again? Is he killing himself with his own again? Why not? Yeah, this guy just kill himself with his own again. Like he does this every time he fights. I don't know why. Oh my god, nice. Where the fuck am I? 
Why am I here? There's so many questions. There's so many questions! Okay, guys, that's enough. So, guys, is the stone step good? Yes. It's not just good, it's meta. It's played in customs. Not as often as a couple other builds, but it is easily one of the strongest builds in the game. But is the stone step good enough to beat the Arbalist and get to place one? No, not quite. It will go to rank two here for the moment, which means Hammer goes down and heirloom goes down and yeah i will put stone safe on rank 2 simply because arbalus is beyond broken arbalus is more accurate better at peaking and does more dps dps might actually be pretty much the same but run royale is all about single firing and with the stone staff the the biggest disadvantage you have is that you actually have to stand still and shoot the weapon you can't like go out shoot once and then keep moving etc you have to commit to the three shots and that is the biggest disadvantage the build has but it's obviously really strong it is in my opinion the best build for console players especially that are newer to the game because aim assist on this thing is absolutely broken i didn't get it of course because i'm on pc but the stone staff in the hands of like a complete beginner on console is still gonna easily do like 2k damage to you despite having absolutely zero aim i think there's one issue like of aim assist and actually the stone staff so my hopes would be that they would attack the aim assist a little bit on console because this is a little bit stupid but yeah where would you guys place it would you place it beyond the Arbalist? you think it's fine here or goes down even further maybe behind the sniper Let let me know in the comments below and do not forget to check out the playlist where we talk about all the other weapons we had so far. The last episode was the revolver, first episode was the atom rifle and we had everything in between as well. Check it out, leave a like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.